military long guns as you started that you said you were looking at different you, you literally were like trying to list out different business ideas like you didn't just fall into lawn and landscape you you literally methodically tried to decide what business what other businesses did you look at what led you to we obviously like sat down and we're like okay what are all the different businesses i mean initially like when i first got out i was like oh like maybe i could start an it business where i could go to people's houses and um you know uh, i would I hand out business cards and like help them set up their tvs yeah. or computers or stuff like that but like that wasn't really something that i was passionate about um when i was younger uh i think when i was like maybe 14 13 14 uh, my dad actually helped me start a mowing business and so me and my buddy got together we were called the money grass cutters mm -hmm. so we handed out flyers and uh, yeah, we just, we, my dad let me borrow the mower and that's kind of how it got started. I think I had maybe like six or seven customers that I would yeah. do, yeah. but I think that planted that entrepreneurial bug mm -hmm. of like, hey, the freedom and the Freedom control. and the money period, exactly. I can totally relate. And the way my dad would routinely, because he is, I think you've heard briefly my story, it wasn't very eloquent, but it was there. Uh, <laughs> but my dad kind of did the same thing, it was like, like I got excited about going and getting a job at 15 because I was gonna make all this money. And, my, and I had been mowing yards for years and my dad was like, EJ, you realize you're gonna make like a third of what you can make in a single hour at a job, at a minimum wage job. You, you can make $25 an hour to mow yards. 